We are online. Our bank and shopping info is online. Our lives are online. And our lives are vulnerable. Just ask the security team at Level 3 Communications in Broomfield. This is the uh, Level 3 uh, Security Operations Center. It's a 24 by 7 uh, staffed organization and uh, they monitor global threats against the internet and against our customers. Level 3 Global Security, this is Matthew, how may I help you? Their job in this highly secure room is to stop the bad guys in their tracks. We monitor over 1.3 billion events uh, a day. We collect 87 terabytes of data a day. Uh, our infrastructure is attacked six times a second. I can run a forensics report if you'd like so we can see exactly how much is getting forwarded. They can't see the data. It's all private, but they know where it's going and where it's coming from. Yeah, I'm in the attack details right now. That bad guy traffic is constantly searching the internet for sure. victims, uh, searching people who have not patched their systems. Their clients, likely many of the banks, stores, and hospitals you use every single day, pay them to be the eyes and ears when you can't. Financial records, credit card data, as well as company intellectual property. And if you think this is overkill, think again. They say the threat is real. In fact, a lot more prevalent than a lot of us probably even realize. In fact, to explain this, I want to show you one of the maps they have here. This is called a threat map. Every blue line on this map is an active threat happening right now. A bad guy pulling information from another computer. And on top of that, they say this is only showing about one out of every 28 attacks as we speak. He says if it showed every attack, you wouldn't even be able to see the map. That's live traffic. Everything in blue is essentially a bad guy stealing data from a company. Now they can't stop every hacker, but when one of their systems is specifically targeted, it's go time. The alarms go off. This operation center will then uh, contact that customer make them aware and give them options where we can block it, we can filter or clean the traffic. It's an alert that you may never even know about, but the companies you use do. You're under an active DOS attack right now. And they hope this Colorado team catches the attackers before it's too late. Does it ever end? Does it ever, does it ever take a break? And never take, the, the bad guys never take vacations.